Hello everyone, welcome back to um, Borderlands 3, this is the guy Chandler here. In the last episode we went to see if we can head off to um so can take care of this guy first. Okay, so uh, what happened in the last episode? In the last episode, we went off to see if we can start our hunts to see if we can get um, to get help to head into the uh, Space Mountain base that we need to go off to, but the way is blocked by a wall of ice. We met um, a bandit hunting um, party and we're going to get their help to find melt the ice to get to the um, military camp. Um, I'm going in the wrong direction. But, uh, yeah. <laughs> So we need to go and open the way for Hamlock. We are basically on the hunt for the window. There's always a secret behind the waterfall. We're in the band camp. on the hemlock.
tough stuff right here. Think I can back it now? Well routed, Bolt Hunter. Alright. Let's get that gate open. Yeah, come on. Not far now, Vault Hunter. Not far now. Come, the windigo awaits. Let's go in. A rather large creature, isn't it? What a busy one. Let us pause a moment. A hunter never goes in for the kill uh. until he knows his quarry outside and in. In this case, in. Here's one, boy. Oh, it's a whiffer. Ah, the odor of seared flesh. Ooh. Indigo must burn its prey to death before eating it. Perhaps we'll find its weakness if we keep searching. Ah, that one is mostly bones. The Windigo must feed on small creatures and also something earthy. Now I mean the truth of stench. The Windigo cannot find small creatures that feed on the mushrooms of the forest. Our path becomes clear. We will bait the Windigo first and then go in for the First, Decelium Avantis, a rare and deadly paralytic. It won't kill a creature the size of the Windigo, but it should daze it enough to make it a fair sloss. Here. Now, to create an effective bait, we will need wolven meat and the juice of some local mushrooms. Meanwhile, I'll keep on the Windigo's trail and make sure the devil doesn't elude us. Okay. So we're looking for... We're looking for meat and mushrooms. I mean, it just sounds like we're making decent shepherd's pie. Kill the howler before he threatens. I again throw this! Death wish? Granted. You got a death wish? Locked. 
back away. And it could lose themselves in the copper labyrinth of the brewery. But what you see is fixing the ice of the stairs. Okay, so we need green, uh, red, blue. Okay, I've got a mission update. 
Go ahead, let's ah. listen to Claptrap. Hey there, Bio! Having a lovely little adventure of your own, are you? What's been going on, bud? So, I got the wizard in a contest of wits atop the spire of <clears throat> cracking despair. I lost horribly and he imprisoned me, but luckily, I still had the call with me, so I busted out! But not before stealing an ancient scroll that says the pearl of ineffable knowledge is, and I quote, Waiting just beyond the veil, in the wailing chasm of Tikdur Gamash! Well, looks like that's my cue! Gotta go! <clears throat> right. Well, Club Trap the Wizard, you go off and do your thing. Just give me a second. I'm wrapping. That's sweet. Splendid Vault Hunter. Not imagine a better hunting partner. Winnie isn't one for hunting. He's blind. With one eye or no. But the good one. Oh, looking into it sets my heart aflame. Nonetheless, we haven't a moment to lose. To the lair, Vault Hunter. Let's grab some ammo. Hack through these roots, Vault Hunter. <sighs> it's time to fight. The wind to go. Here we are. Windigo's lair. <coughs> Steal yourself. From what I gather of this creature, this will be no easy hunt. It's gone for the moment. What luck. Quickly now, give me the bait. Yeah, give me a sec. My strength, Winnie. All I do, I do for you. The creature is coming. Here we go. Where'd I go?
There you are. Hold still. And that's how you hunt. Oh, look at those trophies. That must be the kaif. Grab them, Brister. Ah, kaif is balls. Got it. Right, so I got a new gun. A vault hunter. And pair of flaming donuts. Right, what is this gonna do? Hot belt bruisen source burn. Before we go, a word. Yep, no problem. About what I said earlier, about my confusion. When I laid eyes on the wind to go, I felt fear in my heart. But then I thought of Winnie, and I knew that nothing so pale and formless as fear could ever get in my way. I first became a hunter because for as long as I can remember, I've always been searching for something. Now I see that I have found it, and I am no less the hunter for it. Now, I wish to be at Winnie's side. You have the trophies. Return with them to Eister. Good luck, Vault Hunter. Will do. The first. So, I'm actually going to call this episode off here. Hope you all enjoyed it, and I'll see you all in the next episode. Cheerio.